In this video we're going to look at the separation process called crystallisation. Crystallisation is a separation technique that separates the solvent from a solution. And just to remind us what a solution is, in the image it shows us that the solution is a mixture of a solute dissolved in a solvent. In crystallisation the solvent is evaporated to leave the solute. This diagram shows the equipment that you will need to do crystallisation in the lab. You will need a source of heat, for example a Bunsen burner, a tripod, a gauze and an evaporating dish. An example of something that you could separate using this process is salt water. You should place a small sample of salt water in the evaporating dish and gently heat. The water will evaporate and it will leave salt crystals behind. Another example of a solution that you can separate using crystallisation is copper sulphate solution. Again you would gently heat some copper sulphate solution in an evaporating dish. The water would evaporate and it would leave copper sulphate crystals behind. Hi guys, if you enjoyed that last video then please click on the screen to subscribe. You can also find all my videos in one place at gccrevisionmonkey.com. If you're a teacher, check out the Key Stage 3 package at sciencesurgery.com. It contains all of the Revision Monkey videos as well as loads more Key Stage 3 resources.